Hi everyone. Today on the behalf of CCTV desk, I again come with an unboxing of a 32 channel Thick Vision NVR. So basically this is the NVR box. So today we unbox this NVR. So as you know that we when we make any video of any CCTV products, we divide the video into two parts. One part is our unboxing and the second part is uh, technical specification in which we show you live whatever the thing is mentioned in the data sheet we will show you on the system in, in a live mode so firstly let's unbox the camera so uh, first of all i would like that i will show you the work how uh, this nvr comes means, means the packing of the uh, DVR. this camera this nvr this comes with a very good packing this is uh, red and blue red and white box and everything is mentioned means the main means the main features and the uh, here is this model number and the maximum price is there and in front of in front view also a key feature is mentioned this is all about the packing so let's unbox this uh, and we are so first we remove the equipment speaker and then we will do the lock this is When it it's come with this kind of packing, so let's remove the supporting armor. This is NVR, and this is user manual. NVR, it's come with a HDMI port and a one VGA port, audio in and audio out, one LAN port, one use, uh, one power, and one on off button. It's a 12 volt adapter in front panel. One USB is also there. So this is a Hikvision NVR, and against one one more box in which the adapter is there, and a power cable is there, and a mouse is there, and a one touch port is there, and a different screws uh, to install the hard disk and a SATA cables. The model number of this NVR is DS7632 NI K2 NVR. K2 means it is come with a double SATA hard disk. Each hard disk support up to 8 terabytes but in a safest mode i will use 6 terabyte in this nvr the the key feature of this nvr is this is comes with a 32 input means you can use maximum 32 camera you can run 32 ip camera in this nvr it support a maximum of 8 megapixel of camera means you run 8 megapixel camera Number of camera you can use is 32, and in you can use 4 megapixel, 2 megapixel. Is it, it's, it's your uh, need? It depends on your need. And it's come with the H.265 compression and H.265 plus. The main thing, the best thing of H.265 compression is that uh, it take maximum store. It is it's give you a maximum storage and a lesser bandwidth. It means and the internet required to view online or on net it, it, it consumes less bandwidth of networks uh, it's a 4k nvr means you the you can uh, you this camera and uh, this nvr display a 4k video means if you have a smart tv of 4k this give you a best best picture to uh, to, to give us to 
use this NVR in a in to use this NVR capacity capacity in a maximum way. So you need a 4K HDMI cable and a 4K TV. In that case, it's it's give you a best pixel camera. Is it's give it showing the best image of the camera. So as you all know in. Uh, as you already uh, already know that uh, the main use of NVR is used to search a recording, used to uh, view all the camera in a one place, and, uh, and 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 to show and to view the camera online. These all things is mentioned. Uh, we make a different different video on a different parts means how to how to create recording, how to search backup. How to take backup in a pen drive? Uh, these all the videos we cover in a different uh, earlier. So you um, you go to our playlist, or we will give you a, a, a i button links, or we will mention you in descriptions. All the things means all the equation functions means how you how you use this uh, and we are how you online this and we are this all thing which this all thing we already make a video earlier. Yeah, and we will show you in our description. So the maximum band incoming bandwidth is 256 Mbps and outgoing bandwidth 150, 160 uh, Mbps. HDMI uh, output is 4K and a VGA output is 192 into 1080p at a 60 hertz. And video output mode is HDVI and VGA independent output. Both are different. I mean, you can simultaneously view uh, uh, LDMI and VGA also. And the decoding format is L.2665. Uh, you can use two channels at the rate of one from uh, eight MP, and the remaining four channel four channel four MP. And the eight channel is one zero zero p. So remote connection SATA it's come with a two SATA interface, and in in data sheet it is mentioned that each SATA support up to ten terabyte. But in my but I I maximum use a six terabyte. So USB four get us two USB four. Power supply twelve volt DC and three point three three ampere. And the weight of uh, this NVR is less than one kg in uh, in the case when audio is not installed. And this is uh, this comes with a CE compliance also. This is all about unboxing. So let's start about the second part. of our NVR, this is 762 NIK2 and this is our technical thing and uh, let's just log in the camera I, here is my IP means IP of the NVR so just log in the camera just log in the NVR so It is asking for the plugin to download. So let's run. In login. One nine two one six eight one two two hundred. So username is admin, and I log in via my password. So here is a live view of the NVR remotely. So when in my case I didn't add any camera. So when you add the camera, live view of the camera will be there. So let's start our configuration parts for which we are making the video. So first thing you should remember is about is our system setting means the model of the NVR and the serial number and the firmware versions. These things you need when you take a tech support. When you call in our technical support number, so you should mention these things first. So according to that, they will give you a support. So here in this, here maintenance, here is upgrade options, reboot. Basically, here you see the default, restore and defaults. 
when you change then you are settings and certain thing is not happening in our in, in our way so in that case you just restore the settings so when you restore the NVR, it's come with the factory settings means whatever the company is making whatever setting what is the ideal setting it's come with with that so here is the camera management options in this i i already add the 32 cameras so in in that case you just you just add modify or delete whenever you when you delete any camera then click on add it is asking for ip address and everything so let us start the modify so here it is asking for ip address of the camera protocol if you are using higvision protocol you can use higvision otherwise there are so much thing on wave acti vivo tech sony sanyo on wave so everything is mentioned and you use just your username and password of the camera to start your and then click on okay you just start the value of the camera in user management uh, simply you can make users and just click on the add so when you in user like that admin and the uh, operator or user and you need to access whatever means like for example you make a new user of admin one and you just need that operator so here only few things is mentioned which can access by the operator so when you user only two things mentioned so you can change according to the uh, your need means you get you give access to only those things which which you need to give him for example you need to give him only that uh, admin one is only search record so in that case he will only search record if, if you show that admin one uh, give uh, you can you you want to give the admin one only the live view of the camera so in the in that case you, you just uh, give whatever only remote live view and and untick all the options in that case you can you start making so here is the image option you can change the uh, image of the camera from here also uh, what you use there it is also a, a camera options as you need a storage so in that case first is storage management so here is my hard disk so you can uh, install the hard disk it will show you here and you can select on them and just start the format and advanced settings and net hdd hdd detections so whatever cloud storage if you want and here is the options so advanced settings you can change uh, whenever you just pause the recording or you schedule the recording according to your choice so this is all about uh, technical things so as now just go to data sheet so it is usual that but it is a 32 channel and we are uh, at output 4k and coming back with 160 and the two-way audio that I means uh, decoding format at 265 plus so here recording resolutions is 8 mp so red option is also there so network decoding and now come the networks it support almost every kind of networks poe is there rate so there is no rate means rate zero rate one rate so you you can't because this is a basic and we are the absolute interface it's come with a two sata means you can uh, use two hard disk uh, capacity up to six terabyte of each hard disk so there is a general parameter power supply 12 volt 40 watt consumption less than 14 watt working temperature is there unity is there dimension is there 385 319 means you according to that dimension you can you you select our your, your network right so hope you all understand the things just thanks for watching please like subscribe and share my video and uh, in that uh, in the description you can you can find how to access hard how to access recording in nvr how to playback record how to take backup uh, of hdvn nvr uh, and the different operating things in hdvn nvrs so uh, thanks for watching once again that's all about this video